Hello and welcome to my toy corner. My last action figure review will be a blast from the past. I'm going to take a look back at the McFarlane Toys of the Matrix series. This is series one, Trinity and Neo. As you can see, I already took the liberty of opening Neo up. I couldn't wait. <laughs> I did that one off camera, so there's not much to review there. Uh, but I will open up Trinity for you and kind of highlight some of her details, features, and accessories and what she comes with. Hopefully I'm not the only one that is super excited about the Resurrections. I can't wait to see which direction that they're going. And just to have Neo resurrected is exciting enough to me. So let's take a look at these. So a few things I want to call out here and I'm just in awe. I, I honestly, looking through the package, I thought this is going to be a complete dupe. Um, you know, and, and not to call out any specific toy companies, Hasbro. Um, for you know reusing molds or anything like that, but they could have easily easily reused this piece for both Neo and Trinity and they did not look that is completely Unique mold a completely different scene set. That's one thing I thought was really cool another thing just kind of glancing at it I thought maybe they did the same thing like the reused mold for the back piece there behind Neo But it is not look at that. Do you remember those bullet effects? A legacy that the Warshack brothers brought to us uh, that is just look at the look at the detail in the paint on the tiles the indentations for the bullet wounds the splatter effects just <laughs> incredible all right here's the base plate we've got the shells all the debris the concrete uh, the wash the different paints and the sculpt is just amazing absolutely outstanding and then Carrie Ann herself. Look at that. Uh, if you're like me, you probably remember that outfit very well and watching that scene over and over again. Oh, and the, and the shoes! The shoes! <laughs> the shoes. The detail on the cape, and like I said, the figures themselves, of course, um, you know, just some outstanding detail here. You're not going to get a whole lot of posability. You've got a small little arm joint there. You've got one elbow that moves. This arm goes back and forth. The neck will twist. Um, the legs also have very limited movement. They do they do have a, a hinge there. Oops, almost felt like a 20 year old figure. That's great, Dan. That's great. Um, but they do <laughs> they do move. Um, you may notice the metal post here on the bottom. That is to support her in that pose. Um, the one that you saw from the package there. And is to support her in this pose right here. As we get this assembled, I'm gonna take a break, pull back. I will flip back around here. And I apologize, I did forget to highlight, she does come with a little um, automatic pistol there. So I believe that was from the scene in the movie. There she is assembled. Talk about a balanced breakfast. Those of you on Instagram might know what I'm talking about. I'm just gonna walk you through it really quick here. Probably no pictures at the end. I'm gonna try to keep this one quick. Up close and personal. I do love that matrix code in the background too, that is so cool. All right, so just highlighting some of the detail in there on that set. Now, one thing, if you're interested in these, uh, believe it or not, it, for what you get, this is pretty good. You can still find them aftermarket. I've seen a few auctions for them, a few listings on eBay, less than $20 for some of these. About the only one that you're going to pay an extreme amount of money for is the Morpheus with the chair. If you're familiar with that scene, I'm sure if you watch the movie, you are. That has never gone down in value. I don't know why. It must be the chair, but that thing has always been super expensive. Um, but these two, uh, you can find similar ones like this, less than 30, some less than 20 for Neo and, and uh, some of the other uh, Morpheus and Trinities and some of the other characters. So if you're interested, check them out. Hope you can find them. Good luck. And as always, thanks for watching.